Over time, astrologists and scientists have begun to pay more attention to the idea that there may be life in other galaxies and planets. Could we be the only human civilization in the whole of our galaxy? Or is there another advanced alien life millions of light years away from us? In this video we will answer all of your questions about life existence right outside our planet. So what do astrologists and space physicists know about this space object? And, what is it about this thing that makes it habitable? Watch this video till the end to understand and, hey, don't forget to take along with you a thick sweater because, we're going on a journey to a very cold icy world. According to a recent study, Enceladus, a moon of Saturn, has a less salty subterranean ocean than the oceans on Earth. This increases the likelihood that life will exist in Enceladus Ocean. Due to the discovery of active geysers near Enceladus South Pole by the Cassini probe in 2005, scientists are confident that there is a liquid ocean beneath the frozen surface of the moon. In the plumes, Cassini also discovered methane, salts, water vapor, ice particles, and a variety of complex organic compounds. The frozen surface of Enceladus, one of Saturn's moons, hides a vast ocean of liquid water. Water vapor plumes were found erupting, from the south polar surface of the dwarf moon in 2005, by NASA's Cassini mission. Additionally, Cassini demonstrated that Enceladus' subsurface ocean may be able to sustain some types of life. Heat, mineral nutrients, and organic matter are all present. The Massachusetts Institute of Technology MIT, issued a new study on July 20, 2022, which contends that the ocean on Enceladus is a little less salty than the oceans on Earth. Coupled with the previous findings, this new finding bolsters the possibility of life in Enceladus Ocean. Wayne Ying Kang led the research team at MIT. The researchers were able to estimate the saltiness by studying how the surface ice covers the ocean below. They published their peer-reviewed findings in Science Advances on July 20, 2022. Hey, if we've given you a fresh discovery today or in some ways added to your knowledge of existing life on other planets please support us by subscribing to this channel and giving this video a like. Also turn on notifications to always get notified when we upload a new content like this one. Carmela Padovic Callahan wrote about the tantalizing results in New Scientist on July 20, 2022. The salinity of Enceladus Ocean on Enceladus, the salinity of the ocean, the silicate core and the ice shell all have significant impact on the ocean dynamics and habitability. As the paper outlined, of profound astrobiological interest, Enceladus appears to have a global saline subsurface ocean, indicating water-rock reaction at present or in the past, an important mechanism in the Moon's potential habitability. Here, we investigate how salinity and the partition of heat production between the silicate core and the ice shell affect ocean dynamics and the associated heat transport, a key factor determining equilibrium ice shell geometry. In particular, the researchers wanted to know how the thickness of the ice shell relates to the salinity of the ocean. Saltier subsurface oceans should, generally speaking, have thicker ice over a planet's or moon's poles. Less salty oceans would have thinner ice. The study showed that the salinity level on Enceladus is likely intermediate. As the New Scientist article explained, the team devised a theoretical model detailing how ocean salinity, ocean currents and ice geometry affect each other on a planet or a moon, then tweaked it to best reproduce the properties of Enceladus's ice. From the paper, the pronounced ice thickness changes found on Enceladus are most compatible with the scenarios examined here with heating that occurs primarily in the ice shell and an intermediate range salinity. Salinity not the only factor. Salinity isn't the only factor when it comes to habitability, though. As the New Scientist article mentioned. David Stevens at the University of East Anglia, UK, says that the behavior of ice and water on other planets is directly related to their habitability. At the same time, salinity is only one factor, he says. Thinner ice over Enceladus poles. Interestingly, the results of the study indicate that the ice over Enceladus poles is thinner than at its equator. That would point to a less salty ocean. More specifically, the specific variation in ice thickness suggests that the ocean's salinity could be as high as 30 grams of salt in a kilogram of water. That's salty, 
but less than Earth's oceans, which have 35 grams of salt per kilogram of water. Overall, that sounds promising for the potential for life. The waters are salty, like oceans on Earth, but not too salty. If anything, Enceladus Ocean may be a bit more benign than oceans on our planet. Heat from the seafloor of Enceladus Ocean. Another intriguing finding seems to support earlier data from the Cassini mission. The team found evidence for heat emanating from the ocean floor in Enceladus. Previous analysis by Cassini of water vapor and organics in Enceladus' famous plumes suggested the existence of hydrothermal vents on the ocean floor. This new evidence would seem to agree with that, although more study is needed. On Earth, such hydrothermal vents create an oasis for many different types of organisms. They provide essential heat and nutrients in the otherwise dark and hostile depths of the oceans. Let us know in the comments section below, what you think about life on other space objects other than Earth, and what you think about how life will be like on the cold icy moon of Saturn Enceladus. Hey, how long, in days do you think astronauts take to get to the moon? Well, don't bother thinking about it, it's definitely not what you imagined. We've done out research and we now have a video for you. Thanks for watching. Support us by subscribing to this channel and giving this video a like to make it get to other space enthusiasts like you. Also turn on notifications to always get notified when we upload a new content like this one.